You know, one of the bigger news events of the week that just keeps growing has been the reaction to Fox News' coverage of the well-documented sex scene that can occur within BioWare's Mass Effect. Apparently, it was Martin Luther King Day, no longer satisfied with live shots from Atlanta. Fox News decided to debate the most important issue of the day, the corrupting influence of an act of virtual intimacy in the game intended for adults and available since late November. The ensuing spectacle was nothing short of an act of journalistic periods where a litany of falsehoods about the game were detailed by the anchor and, quote, psychology expert Cooper Lawrence, who happily admitted to never playing the game herself. The only empirical expert to contradict these claims was Jeff Keighley, who was not only patronized, but wasn't even afforded the simple courtesy of equal time to set the record straight. Although when he did get a word in edgewise, it only served to illustrate the stunning purposelessness of the situation. And I might add, he did it with far more composure than I can drum up when confronted with the insipid ramblings of self-serving demagogues. Of significant note was EA's unequivocal response in defense of the game and demands that Fox News set the record straight. As of this taping, Fox has not retracted the misstated facts, but only offered time to Electronic Arts on one of their shows. No correction, but only an effort to get more mileage out of the situation. We contacted EA, who told us, quote, Typically, Fox gets it. They cover games and we invite the people to our events. This one went south when they invited an expert who knows nothing about games, but is willing to say anything to promote a book, end quote. It is becoming distressingly common in this day and age that discussions about culture are hijacked by politicians and the media only to simplify their meaning and lock out legitimate voices. Lucky for me, I have a television show. And taking a cue from Fox News' indisputable integrity, I have this to say to Mrs. Lawrence. I haven't read your book, but it completely sucks. I, for one, feel that it should be kept out of the hands of impressionable young women for fear that they, too, might develop into the appalling simpleton that you have demonstrated yourself to be. But then again, Rupert Murdoch wouldn't have it any other way. Introducing the all-new X-Play, weeknights at 8 on G4.